Women have served in the United States House of Representatives since the 1917 entrance of Jeanette Rankin from Montana, a member of the Republican Party. Nearly 300 women have since served as U.S. Representatives. As of November 2018, there are 85 women in the U.S. House of Representatives not counting five female territorial delegates, making women 19.5% of the total of U.S. Representatives. Women have been elected to the U.S. House of Representatives from 46 of the 50 states. The states that have not elected a woman to the U.S. House of Representatives are Alaska, Mississippi, North Dakota and Vermont. Though Alaska, Mississippi and North Dakota have elected women to the United States Senate. Women have also been sent to Congress from five of the six territories of the United States. The only territory that has not sent a woman to the U.S. House of Representatives is the Northern Mariana Islands. California has elected more women to Congress than any other state, with 41 U.S. representatives elected since 1923. To date, no woman has ever been elected from more than one state at different times in her career. Firsts Jeanette Rankin entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1917 as the first woman in both chambers of Congress. Florence Prague Khan entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1925 as the first Jewish woman in both chambers of Congress, U.S. Representative Vera Buchanan died in 1955, making her the first woman in both chambers of Congress to die in office. Patsy Mink, an Asian American, entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1965 as the first woman of color in both chambers of Congress. U.S. Representative Charlotte Reed became the first woman to wear pants in the U.S. House of Representatives or U.S. Senate in 1969. Shirley Chisholm entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1969 as the first African American woman in both chambers of Congress. U.S. Representative Yvonne Brathwaite Burke became the first member of the U.S. House of Representatives or U.S. Senate to give birth while in office and first person to be granted maternity leave by the Speaker of the U.S. House of Representatives in 1973. With the birth of her daughter Autumn, the gym of the U.S. House of Representatives with the exception of its swimming pool first opened to women in 1985, the gym having previously been male only. The swimming pool opened to women in 2009, the pool having previously been male only. Ileana Rose Leightonen entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1989 as the first Latina in both chambers of Congress. Tammy Baldwin entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 1999 as the first openly gay woman in both chambers of Congress. Nancy Pelosi became the first female House Minority Whip in 2002. She went on to become the first and only to date female Speaker of the United States House of Representatives in 2007. Also in 2007, Maisie Hirono entered the U.S. House of Representatives as the first female Buddhist in both chambers of Congress. In 2011, the U.S. House of Representatives got its first women's bathroom near the chamber room H211 of the U.S. Capitol. Tulsi Gabbard entered the U.S. House of Representatives in 2013 as the first Hindu person in both chambers of Congress. Also in 2013, Kirsten Sinema entered the U.S. House of Representatives as the first openly bisexual woman in both chambers of Congress. In the 2018 general elections, there was a wave of firsts elected to the United States House of Representatives for the 116th Congress. A record-breaking 103 women have been elected or re-elected into the United States House of Representatives. Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib became the first Muslim women ever elected to either House of Congress, with Tlaib the first Palestinian American woman elected to Congress and Omar the first Somali American of either gender to be elected. Also in this election, Angie Craig became the first lesbian mother to be elected to Congress. Sharice Davids became the first lesbian Native American elected to the U.S. House of Representatives. Deb Holland became the first Native American woman elected to the U.S. House of Representatives. Alexandria Ocasio Cortez became the youngest woman to be elected into either House of Congress. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Widows' succession. May Ella Nolan was the first woman elected to her husband's seat in Congress, which is sometimes known as the Widows' Succession. In the early years of women in Congress, the seat was held only until the next election and the women retired after that single Congress. She thereby became a placeholder merely finishing out her late husband's elected term. 
As the years progressed, however, more and more of these widow successors sought re-election. These women began to win their own elections. Thirty-eight widows have won their husbands' seats in the House, and eight in the Senate. The only current example is Representative Doris Matsui of California. The most successful example is Margaret Chase Smith of Maine, who served a total of 32 years in both houses and became the first woman elected to both the House and the Senate. She began the end of McCarthyism with a famous speech, The Declaration of Conscience became the first major party female presidential candidate and the first woman to receive votes at a national nominating convention, and was the first and highest ranking to date woman to enter the Republican Party Senate leadership in the third highest post of chairwoman of the Senate Republican Conference. The third woman elected to Congress, Winifred Huck, was similarly elected to her father's seat. <laughs> Number of women Number of women in the United States House of Representatives and Senate by Congress Number of women in the United States Congress 1917 <laughs> Number of women in the United States House of Representatives by party Notes. Percent of party is taken from voting members at the beginning of the Congress, while numbers and percent of women include all female House members of the given Congress. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Percentage of women by party and year. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> List of female members. This is a complete list of women who have served as U.S. Representatives or Delegates of the United States House of Representatives, ordered by seniority. This list includes women who served in the past and who continue to serve in the present. Female members elect These are women who were elected on November 6, 2018 to serve in the United States House of Representatives but whose term of office has not commenced yet. They are ordered by the date on which their term of office is expected to commence. Pregnancies There have been ten female members of the House of Representatives who were pregnant and gave birth at least once during their tenure one member three times. See also Women in the United States Senate List of female state governors in the United States